maybe talk about the business a little bit and kind of what that's like, uh, you know, walking on set and all the things that are going on around you outside of the actual scene. Right. So, yeah. I mean, what's the, again, I've been around show business a little bit. I've been around some video shoots, some yeah. music video shoots, um, some commercial type stuff. Yeah. And I, I remember being shocked the first couple of times going, damn, there's a lot of people. Yeah. Here. So I mean, there's like people everywhere on yeah, these things. Okay. So the agency is the booker, right? So they're yeah. the ones um, who are kind of have to be the bad guys sometimes and say no to companies that want to hire me. Okay. So the companies go through them first and then my agency asks me if I want to do something. And then you get the final say. Yes. Okay. So, um, Oh, so you're not contractually obligated to do mm-hmm. X amount of films per year or anything like nope, a, maybe like a, a music artist. Yeah. Some agencies might require a contract. Like we want you to stay with us on contract. You can only shoot for with our, booking through our agency for two years or one year, but some agencies don't and it's no pressure on the performer. Okay. So okay. it just depends on what agency you choose. But um, yeah, so sometimes you'll go on set and I learned this, there won't be a makeup artist. Um, there, you kind of have just have to show up with whatever you know how to do with your face. Okay. Um, uh, they don't provide wardrobes. So you have to go out of pocket and pay for lingerie and outfits that you can only wear for this one movie. Cause and, you can't do it two times, right? Yeah. yeah. And then um, there'll be like, either one person on set and it's the guy you're shooting with and he's just kind of filming it while you do your thing or you're with like 10 people on set. There's a personal assistant. I've been on a set where we were there for like 12 days, 12 hours, sorry, because it's uh, a very scripted movie. So it, it's uh-huh. acting, right? Yep. So it's a lot of script um, and there'll be a ton of people there and there was a lady like who has a leaf blower blowing your hair for photos, <laughs> following you around with a leaf blow. I've been on some crazy sets. Okay. Um, and then some that are just you and a random guy and you just show up and do your thing. I'm a lot pickier nowadays. Like after I've been in for a minute, I know like I don't have to shoot with a random old man on a couch. I can choose who I want to shoot with and whatever makes me happy. And yeah, I want to keep this as a career. So there's some kind of a negotiation process. Sometimes it happens like, yes, I will do the shoot. Here are my contingencies. Yes. These are the people I love to work with. I, I have great chemistry with, mm-hmm. um, and these are the people I will never work with again. Um, you have like a no list and a yes list. And um, when you're on set, you also, a lot of fans don't know this, but you're able to talk to each other first and tell you like, what are you not comfortable with? Because right. I'm not going to choke you or slap you in the face if you're not comfortable with that. Boundaries, yeah. Yes. So it's it's literally a business. None of it is for our pleasure. It's for the, the viewer. Yeah, I think it's important for people to hear. Mm-hmm.